everyone, my name is Chelsea and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time tuning into one of my videos. Uh, today is Sunday, which means it is a speed build day. So you're not going to believe what I'm presenting to you today. It's a speed build and it's actually Saturday for the large majority of my audience, but um, that's okay. This is my house. It's about me here. So it's Sunday. I'm posting this on Sunday. It's my Sunday. So this is a Sunday video. You get speed builds every Sunday. All right. You get apartment builds on uh, your actual Sunday. And when I say your, I'm obviously referring to the people who um, are not from the future like myself. Uh, but actually, no, you don't because apartment builds go out on Monday. You see what I'm saying? It's my Monday, my house. Yeah, we're on the same page. Cool. All right. Uh, cutting the rambling. Let's get into talking about the build a little bit, shall we? This I've really cleverly named this. <laughs> You guys are not going to believe what I've come up with for the name of this here house. Little Blue Starter Home. The starter being in air quotes because it's not actually a starter home at all. It's uh, it's mm -hmm. it, it's quite expensive. I don't. I actually wrote down how much it is. Sorry, let me just uh, get into my private dumping ground at Discord server. Fifty six thousand five hundred and ninety five simoleons uh, is what this place costs furnished. So yeah, obviously not actually a starter home. Personally, when I say start a home, I think of a home that like you move into and just start your little family off, okay? It's like you don't stay here for long. It's I actually call these stepping stone homes. Maybe I should have called this, I don't know, a little blue stepping stone or something like that. That actually would have been really cute, but I've already exported it. Oh, bummer. Well, I could go back and change it, but uh, whatever. Okay. Well, what a wasted opportunity. Anyway, here we go. Little blue quote-unquote starter home okay yeah that's do you know why i named it that because there's a bit of blue on the exterior you see that yep <laughs> anyways um i don't know why i did what i did with this build for this hair build i wanted to do like a really small build like i wanted to do a small house i was in the mood for a small house and i was like i don't know for some reason i wanted to put a fake house uh on the right of it i don't know i wanted like a I wanted sort of like a crammed up lot, but it was still a really small house. And yeah, <laughs> that's it. That's my explanation. I saw something similar to this on Pinterest and I was like, yeah, let's do that. That sounds fun. But yeah, um, when I say this is a stepping stone, you won't be in here for long house. Uh, I really mean it. And by that, I mean one bedroom, one bedroom, one bathroom. Okay. Oh, the... <laughs> No, it's still technically one bedroom. Okay, there's like a little nook, if you will, in the uh, master bedroom, aka the only bedroom. There's a little nook in the bedroom that has like a, a small nursery type thing. So, I mean, I guess you could say it's one and a half bedrooms. It's not really one and a half bedrooms, but I guess you could say that if you wanted to. It's There's a master bedroom and there's like a wall that separates. You'll see it when I do it. Okay, um, I don't need to sit here trying to explain it because... um. Yeah, frankly, no point. You're literally gonna see it with your uh, your own two eyes. Um, one thing to note about this build is I did another pretty interesting thing here. I uh, completely blocked out the garage. You know why I did that? Because the bushes were cutting into the garage and I couldn't be bothered dealing with it. Sorry, still a little bit lazy, okay? I'm really not lazy when it comes to my speed builds these days for the most part. Uh, I'll, there's a few exceptions. Uh, sometimes I do still get a little bit lazy and I got a little bit lazy here, so. No access to the garage for you. <laughs> Obviously, though, if you want to change that, uh, you can edit this house. You can do whatever you want. Uh, but in order to do that, in order to make any changes to like the exterior, it functions like an apartment. It functions like all of my like other townhouse builds and stuff like that. Uh, there's markers blocking off the other house and also the garage garage. I don't really. I say garage, but I know a lot of you say garage. Uh, I don't really know why I felt like clarifying that just there because usually I don't anyways. If you want to like, there's markers blocking them out. If you want to make any like changes and stuff, you're just going to have to use the restrict build by and buildings cheat. You need to have testing cheats enabled on before you can put that one in. And then you're golden. You can do whatever the heck you want. Uh, but yeah, I enjoyed building this house. As with all of my other builds, uh, I built this on stream. Well, mostly. Okay. Obviously, I don't do the shell on stream. We know me. Okay. I talk about this all the time. Bloody petrified to build houses from scratch uh, on stream in front of everybody. So didn't do the shell. I did the shell just before stream, actually. Just prior. I spent maybe an hour just fiddling about in, uh, 
and the sims and got the show done and recorded that but didn't stream it and then i did everything else on stream but as far as actually you know what no i think i did the majority of this house off stream uh i think i decorated up to the hallway on stream and then the rest of it i did in my own time i did that off stream mm. i'm really fascinated that we're five and a half minutes into the video and we're still working on the exterior like ugh. i never usually take this long to do exteriors what the hell god i must have been so distracted this day this was 100 percent um well i mean it was 100 percent i streamed this part but like yeah i feel like it, it's kind of noticeable the parts that i've done on stream because wow it's taken me a long time to do everything oh um just as we're doing this part here a little, i'd just like to pause and point out once again i've done nothing to the backyard sorry about that i just really cannot be bothered i also did another thing with this build that i haven't done before um i used a little a pattern that i quote unquote made i've never made a pattern before and frankly i didn't even fucking make this one okay what i've done is i took the really 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 bloody shiny ea wood pattern the one that really pisses me off if any of you have been like watching my stream vods or if you've been hanging out in my streams uh you've possibly heard me go on about how much i hate the shiny patterns in the sims 3 the shiny woods really piss me off why are they so shiny i just hate shine in this game i'm also starting to really hate occluders as well um but i'll get into that later probably unless i forget anyways um i took an ea like the really shiny ea wood pattern um i just exported the look of it the pattern the mask whatever uh and i pretty much just recreated that pattern and uh just made it without the shine so yeah there'll be download links to that obviously in the uh cc list of this house but yeah i did that i also used a plain texture pattern sorry i made a plain pattern because sometimes the misc and the, the pattern in the misc category sometimes i feel like that's a bit shiny and i was getting annoyed with that too so i did the exact same thing with the white pattern that's actually technically nothing yeah just getting really pedantic when it comes to the sims uh at the moment i don't really know why everything's just really starting to piss me off i don't know maybe it's just because i'm getting old and grumpy i'm 29 in a couple of months isn't that wild that's actually disgusting i don't want to think about it anymore okay yep nope i'm done with that thought oh my god by the time this video goes up oh ugh. um nope sorry i've just realized by the time this video goes up um it's less than two months because this video is going up on the 20 something i think it's the fourth when I'm recording this. I'm so ahead of just absolutely everything. I've pretty much got ready, readies. I've got videos ready, essentially, uh, for the entire month of June. That's not true. Uh, I have... Um, uh, that apartment build is going up this week. Uh, one, two... I've got two apartment builds I need to do. Uh, and then I've got another apartment build to do, and then a normal build to do. And then that's, like, covered. All of June, just done guess what day it is i think i might have already said it actually 4th of june it's the 4th of june today yep i just really love filming i just really love sims i've gone on about this plenty of times we don't need to uh listen to me repeat myself so yeah i, I just really love sims I'm really enjoying myself i did do a five and a half hour no not five and a half a four hour and oh god what was it oh my god i nearly choked on my saliva sorry about that um today i streamed the sims 4 not the sims 4 the sims 3 uh the sims 3 4 sorry i'm trying to look and i can't navigate a website because once again i'm really old oh okay never mind it was four and a half hours all right i thought i streamed sims for like four hours and 45 minutes today but no turns out that's not the case overwatch is really really just dying on my channel and by that i mean like I'm barely streaming it. It's terrible. I streamed for five hours and 55 minutes today. Four and a half of them were in The Sims. Like I said in my last commentary, which fuck knows when that went up, <laughs> quite frankly, I just really feel like more of a Sims creator than I do uh, an Overwatch streamer at the moment. And honestly, I kind of love that for me. I'm having a great time. I'm having a blast. Still don't think I'm burnt out, like even remotely close to burning myself out, but I think I actually struggle with um, being able to detect when i'm burning out so uh, for all i know i actually could be burning out really really hard right now and i've just got no idea <laughs> i don't think i'm burning out but i could be not sure anyways another thing 
let, let me just dabble in this a little bit. Let me just talk about this. The occluders thing, because occluders are starting to piss me off as well. Uh, so see behind this mirror here, for example, that fucking shadow, that really, really deep, annoying shadow behind the mirror there. It's behind pretty much everything, actually. At the bookshelf, there it is. Yep, behind those. Uh, that's an occluder. The thing that like makes that shadow happen, that is the occluder. I don't know if I'm saying that right, actually. I don't really care if I am. I hate those things, so they don't really deserve the respect of me uh, giving a shit if I am pronouncing it correctly. Quite frankly, fuck those things. Anyways, that's the occluder. Really pissing me off. Another, like I said, like it's just another thing on the list of things that have started pissing me off as I, you know, age, I guess. Um, yeah, so I've gone through. I've edited my full build uh, files, which if you don't know, those are like your game files. They're like packaged files uh, that pretty much like hold everything. Like they hold all the objects that are in the game. They hold, they just hold a whole lot of stuff. I went in there. I edited like those files, which is scary. Don't do that if you don't know what you're doing or you're going to absolutely break your game. I'm so serious. Like make sure if you're going to mess with those, please know what you're doing. Or yeah, no, you actually will break your fucking game. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not messing around there. I'm very, very serious. Don't do that. Again, unless you know what you're doing. Anyways, moving on. Yeah, went into those files, um, replaced the light file of uh, quite a few objects just to completely get rid of the shadow because I was just really fucking sick of it. I was just real damn sick of it. I think I've already done it by this point, actually. No, I haven't. No. What a ridiculous thing to say. Look how big the shadow was behind that mirror there. Of course I hadn't done it by that point. Ugh. Everything from here. Okay, from here onwards, this is everything that I did off stream. So I think, uh, never mind, I clearly haven't done it here yet. <laughs> because uh, I definitely stripped it from that coffee table. But yeah, um, that won't affect your game. Um, you don't need to download anything or anything like that because again, I edited my personal, like in my computer, like my game files, I edited those. Uh, so it won't affect you. Uh, if you like the occluders, then don't worry. Nothing's gonna happen to you. God, maybe I should just go through. Oh, I should make a little project for myself. I should go through. I should remove the occluders from absolutely all of the base game stuff because I feel like they're really strong on the base game stuff. I should just do that and just upload it. And then y'all can do it too if it pisses you off. If it doesn't, oh, sorry. I've just had a thought. I'm going to feel really, really bad if uh, these occluder things were like these really big shadows. I'm going to feel really bad if these were something that never bothered you. And now that I've pointed it out, it's going to start bothering you. I'm actually going to feel awful if that ends up being the case for anybody. So uh, if it is, yeah, I'm really sorry about that. I didn't think about this before I started rambling. Oh, no, the uh, the occluders look really nice. The only reason I took them out is because um, I uh, I was just bored. I was just bored. That's all. No, the game looks really nice with occluders. Yeah, I actually think I should go in and intensify them, if anything. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gaslighting you. I hate them. I really, really hate them. Mm, no, they're lovely. Like, look at it. Look how nice that is. God, what a big, strong shadow. It just looks really neat, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks really cool. Uh, it doesn't. Anyways, this is the dining area. That's right, everybody. When she brings up a random thing about what's going on in the video, that means she's run out of things to say. Yeah, boy, have I run out of things to say. Goodness gracious me. I just feel like I've got absolutely nothing to ramble about today. I did kind of say that in my last video though, and then I proceeded to ramble for like 20 minutes, so maybe I'm just full of shit. I don't know. Maybe I'll just sit here and just keep rabbiting on and then something will pop into my brain that I deem interesting enough to uh, share with you, but mm, I don't know. Life's just kind of feeling a bit meh. Not meh as in like life's bad or anything like that. Like I've actually been feeling fantastic, don't get me wrong. Uh, it's just There's just nothing really going on. Today on stream, actually, I was talking about how I hate being asked, um, like, what's going on? Like, how have you been? What have you been up to? Hate that question. You know why? Because it never changes. My answer never changes, and it's just... <sighs> yep. Um, I don't know what to say when people ask me that question. It's like, uh, even if it's been a couple of months since I've seen you. Like, if you ask me that question, I'm still not going to know what to say, because oh, how have I been? Yeah. Same old, same old. What have I been up to? Same old, same old. Like, I don't know, man. I just really hate that question. I don't know how to answer it. 
I, I think that's actually how I answer it 90% of the time. Literally just same old, same old, because what the fuck else am I going to say? Oh, yeah, no, I took a, um, uh, took a walk a few weeks ago. It was pretty cool. I haven't been on a walk since, like, <laughs> the start of the year. I don't actually even know if I've been on a walk this year. Oh, dear. What a terrible thing to realize. Uh-oh. Moving on. Yeah, just don't know what to tell you. I really don't know what to tell you. Absolutely nothing changes ever with me. Uh, I did lots of streaming. I made lots of videos. I built lots of houses. I played lots of Sims. I slept. Took lots of showers. That's pretty much all that happened. And the last time, uh, between like, last time I saw you and now, that's pretty much it. That's the gist of it. Brushed my hair many, many times. Brushed my teeth many, many times. Washed my face many times. Even had a period. <laughs> Exciting. <laughs> just hate being asked that question. I don't know. Maybe I'm just really weird about it. Does anybody else feel that way? Anyway, having said that, how have you guys been doing? What have you been up to? What's going on? That wasn't funny. Sorry. That was actually kind of predictable, I think. Mm. Yeah, no, y'all definitely saw that coming. Um, oh, uh, sorry. There are a couple more things that um, I did that you'll need to download in order for this house to work. Well, actually, you won't need to download them because, well, not work, but like for it to look the way that it does. And actually, you won't need to download them if you download the package file because it's just included. I edited the rug that I used twice in the bathroom and I edited the light again. And today I loaded into The Sims and put my light in, the new edit, the V3. Yep, that's right. This is Chelsea's small light edit V3. I don't know what the fuck happened to V1. Um, yeah, that's long gone. I don't even know what I did with that one, but whatever. Um, yeah, I put V3 next to v, uh, V2. Realized they're actually pretty much the same thing. So yeah, this is definitely not a necessary download whatsoever. But, you know, at the time I felt good about my light edit and that's the main thing so i did that i also edited uh that rug i made two of the swatches i took two of the swatches and i made them recolorable because i really like that rug and i just wanted to be able to recolor it so i've done that and that's included in the house or is listed on the cc list if you don't download uh the package version of the house yeah I'm gonna re I'm gonna add some like swatches to that rug as well though. Um, I've already actually made them. I just haven't put them on the rug and put the rug in the game yet. I've just been a bit lazy. See, so, so, just a bit lazy. I told you. Anyways, um, we're just about done with the house. I think. Um, let me see how much footage I've got left. Yeah, kind of done. Cool. That's great news because I don't know what the hell to say now. Here's the nursery thing. Okay, no, I I was actually gonna bring this up. Um, uh, that wasn't just me like defaulting to talking about the house because I didn't know what to say. I was genuinely gonna say uh, this when we got to it. But this is what I mean. The little nursery like nook thing. Kind of weird, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit strange <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, but oh well. I could, you know what? If you find that a bit too weird, you can just uh, delete the arch and just turn that into an actual room and then it'll feel a little bit better. I personally would just leave it like this, but that's just me. Actually, you know what? It's not that weird. It's quite cute, actually. They're really... Oh, no, sorry. I just thought about the parents. Uh, the parent sims woohooing. What are they going to do when the child's asleep? Oh, dear. Actually, no, this is really strange. <laughs> Feel free to replace the arch with the door. Do whatever you want. Um, I'm probably not even going to use this house. I'll be perfectly honest with you, so it doesn't worry me. But, you know, if, you, if you're worried about things like that, Feel free to replace the arch with the door, as I said. Anyways, here's the outro music. You know what that means? We're about to jump into some screenshots. So I'm going to wrap my commentary up right here. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please should give it a thumbs up with me. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Speaking of the comments, the download link for this house will be in there, pinned also, if you want to put this into your own game. Along with the list to all of the custom content that I use. Yada, 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 yada. You already know the drill. Okay, I'm out of here. Peace. Thank you so much for watching. I love you a lot. And of course, I will see you next time. Bye bye. Should I get up? Should I get up and run? Stop